Hello my Gemini loves. Today we are going to find out the person on your mind, their current thoughts and feelings about you, their next actions towards you, and what they want to tell you. Okay my loves? I'm Lily. Welcome to my new channel. Everything you need to know will be in the description box below on YouTube. Tapping into your energy Gemini for your intuitive messages it strongly felt like I was getting the energy of your person, but this could be you. So take it how it resonates, okay, my loves? Somebody here, you or them, is really reminiscing on past memories, okay? And I feel like there's this energy of um, really reflecting on past mistakes, okay? So it, it feels like this person is doing some deep reflecting inner healing work. Um, I'm getting that they might keep a journal. I see them like in a cafe or this could be you, <laughs> uh, in a cafe or a coffee shop writing a lot. Um, uh, I also see like someone becoming more spiritual or uh, possibly starting to go to church or something like that. Um, it's really quite beautiful energy. I feel like there's this new opportunity that somebody uh, wants to discuss with you, okay? So, um, yeah, it's really gorgeous. I feel like I was getting Virgo. I picked up on all the air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and Aries. Okay, Sun, Moon, or Rising in any of those placements, but those are strongly coming out. Um, I picked up on some initials, C, J, R, F, T, H. First, middle, last initial. That could be you or them, okay? So let's find out what's going on for your person here. What's, what's their energy spirit? What's going on for Gemini's person on their mind? What do we need to see about Gemini's person? Ah, person, they didn't flip. Uh, Gemini's person, what is their overall energy right now? Coffee cup <laughs> pictures, no way. <laughs> Reminiscing, looking back on past pictures of you and them together possibly. Um, they're really nostalgic, um, wanting to make new memories. Uh, they could be missing you if you guys are disconnected. Um, this is obviously someone you've been in a connection of some sort with. You may not be together currently, but it's not a new energy. So comment in the uh, comments below if you'd like a new love reading, and I'll do that next, okay? Um, but yeah, they're definitely looking at pictures and memories between the two of you. Um, and if you don't have any of that together, then they're just looking at your pictures, okay? Um, and look at coffee cup. I picked up on a coffee shop. Um, meeting and talking. They want to get, their, get together and tell you about some sort of new opportunity. Um, they want to just uh, build, start by building a friendship. If you guys are starting over, they want to have this deep, maybe you are just friends, like a friends of, with benefits perhaps. Um, maybe you had a relationship in the past, but they want to like start properly. <laughs> it's, it's like they're reevaluating all the mistakes they've made and um, it's somehow tied to you, okay? Um, their mood is, they're feeling very elevated, okay? Um, whether that be like they've awakened, they've become more spiritual like I was talking about. Um, but yeah, they just want to savor the moments with you and make new memories. This is gorgeous energy, my loves. Okay, let's keep going. <laughs> Tell me more about the person on Gemini's mind, please. Tell me more about the person on Gemini's mind. What's going on for them? It didn't flip. I don't even know what that said. Oh, soulmate. <laughs> Yeah, soulmate, okay. You guys are definitely soulmates. Uh, tell me what's going on with the person on Gemini's mind. Um, journal! Stop it, I gotta take this ring off. It's driving my thumb nuts. It, look at this, this is exactly what I saw. <laughs> Writing, diary, keeping notes, and they have a cup of coffee in a cafe or a coffee shop. Come through, Spirit, thank you. Yeah. They're really reflecting. This is definitely their energy. 
Um, the letter J, C, or P could be significant here. I said C and J, but I don't think I said P. Um, okay, tell me more about what's going on with the person on Gemini's mind. What is their overall energy? Um, they may ask you to go to um, a coffee shop, perhaps. Let's see. That was too many, guys. Um, what do we have for Gemini's person? What's going on with them? Okay, I flipped it. Hope. <laughs> this is stunning. You guys, they haven't given up. It says, I haven't given up on us, okay? So if you thought it, this was over, this is, uh, they're trying to transform themselves so they can transform this connection with you, okay? Yes, love this. Okay, let's keep going. Uh, Spirit, tell me about this person's thoughts and feelings towards my Geminis. What's going on here? What are their thoughts and feelings for Gemini? There you are, Gemini, at the bottom of the deck, the lovers. They're completely head over their heels in love with you. It's almost like how we saw the soulmate card, right? They know you guys have this really strong soulmate bond, past life connection. It's almost like you were made for each other. And maybe um, because they're really in this reflective state, maybe you guys, the time you guys connected was uh, a difficult time in their life. Um, where they were less mature, um, where they could have had some bad habits. Like, they're really transforming all areas of their life. Um, it says, I will use my wisdom to make important choices, okay? So, they're, like, really, really um, keeping the hope alive between you two, and they want to do things right. Oh, my gosh, I love this. Okay, so tell me about their uh, thoughts and feelings towards Gemini spirit. What is the person on Gemini's mind? Thoughts and feelings for Gemini's. They didn't flip. Thoughts and feelings. They're not flipping. Thought, thoughts and feelings for Gemini. What are their thoughts and feelings for my Gemini's here? Okay. Yes. They want to make an offer. Things have been moving quite slow. And the nice thing about this, this is my favorite night in the deck because it's the pentacles it's grounded it's tangible it's real right it's stable um they want to be consistent where in the past they probably weren't they want to be that person that you can rely on um they have a very strong will and um they're fighting to overcome all the obstacles and past mistakes um, that they had made. They're becoming very responsible, dependable, okay? And they're determined to make this offer. This is 20 degrees of Aries um, and 20 degrees of Taurus. They could be one of those signs or those months could be significant. We're about to move into Aries season, um, April 11th through May 10th, okay, my loves? So um, their heart chakra is activating here, okay? Um, wow, this is beautiful. That's how they're feeling. They're feeling like I want to make an offer. Now that feels like an action, but um, it's they have this is like more of the planning. They could be working on their pentacles, working um, uh, to save money for whatever reason. Tell me more about how they're feeling about my my beautiful um, Gemini's. What are their thoughts and feelings for my Gemini? Oh, now they could be stressing, okay? Now, like I said, they have some air in their chart, okay? And this is a card that always comes out for you. They may think they may think you're stressing out about this situation. There's like this energy of um, anxiety, um, uh, fears, right, creeping in, stinking, thinking. But they're working really hard to get rid of that, okay? Um, but they could be viewing you as someone that feels very overwhelmed by a situation or why this hasn't come together. I mean, this is the Gemini card. <laughs> Okay, tell me more about their thoughts and feelings towards my Gemini, please, Spirit. Five of Swords, interesting. Okay, so Five of Swords is about wanting to win at all costs here, okay? Um, there could have been some conflicts. Oh, that was a weird accent. Conflicts and um, battles between you two, fights and arguments in the past, perhaps. They may feel like you are holding on to, like... Um, past arguments between you two or something like that. Um, 
Yeah, but this is wanting to win and push through at all costs here, okay? Uh, there's three people on this card, so there could be someone else, um, competition or something getting involved here. Um, tell me more about how they're feeling for my, um, they want to communicate. They want to move quickly. They may ask you to travel with them, perhaps. Tell me what's going on. Tell me how the person on Gemini's mind is thinking and feeling for Gemini's, please. How are they, what are their current feelings and thoughts about my Gemini, please? Three of Swords. Yeah, that's interesting because the Five of Swords is holding on to the, uh, the Three of Swords, okay? So they may think you're holding on to some sort of heartbreak here, okay? Or maybe you're dealing with a heartbreaking situation outside of them, perhaps. Um, but yeah, this is also fears and trauma and... Uh, this there's so much air energy here, okay? And obviously, um, you're an air sign, but uh, they could be really reminiscing about the positive stuff, and you they may be thinking now. This is just how they're thinking and feeling that you're holding on to the negative stuff, perhaps. Okay, let's keep going. How do they feel for my jump? Two of cups. They're in love with you, okay? Um, how do they? They know you guys are soulmates. How do they feel about my Geminis? Three of Cups. Three, three. March is very significant here, okay? They feel like they want to have fun with you again. That's what they're focused on, member sweethearts. The fun times, the celebrations. Um, the, they want to date you. They want to take you out. Um, you know, remember how I said, did I mention starting as friends, right? Uh, friendship, building up that friendship, getting that friendship back, right? Um, this is also reconciliation energy. Um, tell me how they feel. How do they feel about Gemini? Three, 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 three. They want to collaborate. They want to team up. They want a partnership with you that leads to marriage, to building properly, right? Um, this is work energy so capricorn energy you could work with them perhaps um but they want growth okay so it's almost like they want to build a friendship first you are a wish fulfillment for them okay my loves last feelings um they have we're gonna see what they want to tell you love messages okay so how are they feeling about Gemini? They want a passionate new beginning, right? They have, they find you very sexy, attractive, um, hands of more beautiful Gemini, okay? Um, they want, they, <laughs> they want some sexy time too, that's for sure, but they don't want to rush into that. They want to build this friendship first. That's Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy, okay, my loves? Let's find out what their next actions are. What are their next actions? There's a three of pentacles again. Okay, so what are their next actions towards Geminis? What are their next actions toward my, towards my Gemini? The person on Gemini's mind. What is their next action, please, Spirit? What is it? Work. Okay, they want to work on this connection. They want to put in the effort. They want to make an effort. Um, they... Their next action is working on it, okay? And um, they're also really working on building their pentacles up, like I said earlier. Um, they could be taking classes. Um, they could be perfecting their skills. They're, they're about uh, development and growth. They want that with you in their life. It's very tangible, Virgo energy here, okay? So they're going to uh, work on it, work on the connection with you. The Three of Cups almost came out again. Uh, what's their next actions towards my Gemini, please, Spirit? So many cards. So many cards. Oh, way too many cards. They want to make you a golden opportunity offer. Okay. What is their next action? Four of Pentacles. They're really holding on tightly to you, okay? They have never let you go. Uh, April could be April 8th. I said that for another... Uh, a collective reading that I did on my other channel. April 8th is the Aries new moon, okay? Something significant could happen then, okay? Um, yes, I'm definitely getting that. Tell me more about what their next actions are towards Gemini. All pentacles. Eight, 
four, and seven, okay? Interesting. They really want to invest in you. They really, they're trying to be patient. They're really, this next action is dependent on their money, okay? Tell me, tell me more. Tell me more, please, Spirit, about Gemini's person's next actions towards Gemini. Oh, look at how they view you. Empress, they might want to get you pregnant. They they view you as this divine feminine. If you're the ma divine masculine, flip it, okay? Um, they want to have a baby with you. They see you as this really beautiful, loving, nurturing person. They see you as their counterpart. So the next action is about growth and abundance and having a family together. Uh, Ace of Cups, a new beginning of love. You guys are soulmates, you guys. The pregnancy is here very strong. So if you don't want to get pregnant, protect yourself. If you're past that stage of life, they just want this uh, really loving, abundant uh, beginning, new beginning with you. Because And the Wheel of Fortune. This does not get more gorgeous than this, okay? Change is coming, you guys. Um... Uh, for sure, okay? You guys definitely are soulmates here. So tell me about um, what they want to tell my Gemini spirit. What does this person on Gemini's mind want them to know? What do they want to tell Gemini? Ooh, this almost came out. Okay, here we go. Here we go. What do they want to tell my Gemini, please, spirit? Ah, so much stuff they want to tell you. Stop! When I look at your pictures... I feel lost in your eyes. Yeah, they are staring. They are just daydreaming about you, looking at your pictures nonstop, okay? For sure, confirmation. <laughs> okay, so I say, it says, I still have hope that we can be together again. Yes. I always get so emotional when I see your beautiful face. They're so in love with you. Um... Yeah, they're trying to be the best version of themselves for you, you guys. The passion between us feels off the charts. I want only you, okay? Let's get a couple more love messages, please, from this person to Gemini. Um, okay, here we go. Here we go. Love messages from Gemini's person to them. What do they want my Gemini to know, please, spirit? I have been dreaming about us having a future together. They absolutely do. And they're working really, really hard, Gemini. Okay. Any other? Okay. We've got, I've been hiding the love that I have for you. Yeah. So they want to start over and they want this to build this friendship. They want it stable. Um, they want it right from the beginning. And then the passion and love, they'll start talking about that more because we're not getting a whole lot of that in this reading because, you know, they want, it's almost like they want to start over like they never met you before, right? Even though you may have, Six of Cups was here. You could have known them for a very, very long time, okay, my loves? <laughs> and then look what this, at the bottom of the deck is what you don't see coming. I love you more than words can express. Uh, you still mean so much to me. They love you so much. So don't ever doubt that, sweethearts, okay? So this looks amazing. I love this so, so much for you. If you enjoyed any of this, please, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps my channel grow just by clicking like. It helps me energetically tap into your energy as well. And I will see you guys again soon. I love you guys so much.